so here in this video we will see how to modify the surfaces as per the master section given so as you can see in this exercise i have one input surface and master section there are three master sections given so first i'm going to create a plane on these master sections So master sections can be used as a reference only they cannot directly use these sections to create a surface so first we have to study all these sections and then we have to create a surface according to that so i am creating these planes so that i can take a clip section on these planes like this so if you notice right there is a difference between the surface and the master section so we have to update this surface as per the master section so you can measure the radius of the fillet like this so as you can see there is a difference between the surface and the section so we have to update all these surfaces and this is the last section So here we have to modify the page blend. So let's start now. So first we will remove these edge blends. So to remove these edge blends, I have to unseal these surfaces first. and now i will delete this surface by using delete body command like this so first i will extend this surface to create a corner like this and then now i can trim the surface so first we have to extend all these surfaces to create a corner so that we can give edge blend after that
so first ex extend all the sheets like this and intersect it with each other and then now we can trim the sheets like this so So let's take a curve here and now we will trim this surface by using that curve. Now let's measure this angle which is 84.84 so we will use So this is 25 degree So we will use draft command to create a surface at an angle of Five degree. Now, if you take a clip section, you will notice that our surface is matching with the master section. So here we have to reduce this surface up to the section. like this now after that let's measure the so first we will join these surfaces Now we can give edge blend here. So we can measure this edge blend from the master section. So first I am joining these two surfaces. like this you can do the edge blend okay so first we will measure this radius this 25 mm so we will give edge blend of 25 mm here and it's done After that, we will extend these sheets to create intersection. Now, once these surfaces intersect with each other, we will bring these surfaces one by one to create a corner.
So let's measure this radius. So to give edge plane, we have to first join these surfaces by using sieve command. Now we can give edge plane here to match it with the master section. Now if you take the clip section here and this plane, you will see it is matching with our master section. Now there is one last section is remaining. So we will unsew these corners to get a good quality of surfaces. Because if you notice that these edges were not matching with the edge blend. So first we will extend these sheets up to here, up to this edge and similarly we will do, it, do this like this. And now we can use two curve here to create a surface. We give tangent continuity on both sides to give support. Now, as you can see, the surface quality is good now. Now let's trim these two surfaces. Now let's join all the surfaces and then give edge blend as per the master section. So if you measure this radius, it is 9 mm. So we will give edge blend of 9 mm here. And it's done. So in this way we update the surfaces as per the master section. So as you can see, our surfaces are matching with the master section. So you can change the color if you want 